Don't adjust your YouTube. It's opposite day. Hey, heathens, what's up? I'm JD Blute. Evil Unicorn's around here somewhere. Although I hear rumors that he is uh, thinking of quitting, but we'll, we'll get to that later on as, as time goes by on the channel. Just some vicious, salacious internet rumors. You know how YouTube can be. Anyway, the inspiration for this video it came about literally just the stupidest thing. Apparently, January 25th has passed, but that is apparently International Opposite Day. I don't know what more I can do, but I needed a break from the learning of the guitar and I wanted to try something just ridiculously stupid. So, we have plain shirt instead of fun shirt. I'm not shaving the head again, so that's staying. We have the floppiest pick I could find. This is a Dunlop 46 millimeter. I don't know. To be fair, I actually like using these on acoustic. To that end, we have my acoustic. This is an Epiphone something or other that has frets that will cut you. If you've seen any of my other guitar reviews, you know what I'm talking about. This is the guitar that I tried to... Uh, here, I'll show you. You know what? You guys deserve to see this. This is the guitar I tried to shave the frets myself. I'm an idiot. Should have never done it. Made it worse. But really, even and truly, uh, up here where you don't really hang out, still cutting the bottom of my fingers painfully. It sucks, and I would never play this guitar regularly. So for opposite day, it fits. I even went so far as to buy a new lav, but also did not put it under the shirt. This is how opposite we are going to be today. I have no idea why. I just, I needed a break. I wanted some fun. You may notice that I am still in my regular playing position. So even though I don't play acoustic very much, You will notice that that sounds like somebody actually playing a guitar pretty competently. What we're going to do for Opposite Day is completely just, oh boy, I, I, don't, I don't even want to, but I'm going to try. And we are actually going to flip the guitar. Now, I don't play drums at all, so I don't mean percussives. Not a drummer. So I program most of the drums. So what we're going to do is we are actually going to put this the right way, as if you were playing. If I had a cheap pair of strings, I would have actually changed the strings over. But what we're going to do is we're going to slide the footstool over to the other side. We're going to move the microphone or the recording device. And we're going to flip this bad boy. The only thing that's not going to happen, and trust me, you don't, there you go, we'll cut, you know what, it's probably better that you don't see me play this. We are going to try. Originally, I wanted to do, you know what, I should probably show you. Originally, I wanted to do So What, which is... That's all I wanted to do. I wanted to challenge myself to learn how to play that. I said, self. It's not that hard. We're just going to be stupid on the internet. We're going to put that there, right in the way of my playing. We're going to try and readjust. I'm not used to, I'm used, so used to setting up for, you know, proper YouTubing, best I can. And we're going to try just to see if we can get anywhere close to, I don't know why I do these things. We're going to try and see if we can make sounds, and we're going to try and see if by the end of this video, first of all, if I still have my sanity, and second of all, if I can play something that sounds even a little bit like so what. Place your bets in the comments below. I will let you know this is the second time I have tried this today. It did not go well the first time. So this is with maybe five minutes of experience that you don't see on camera, 
We've gotten it out of the way as best we can. So, this is the first effort. Remember, I didn't flip the strings. I should have, but that wouldn't truly be an opposite. Added bonus, my uh, iPhone's camera is pixelating. Perfect. This is great. Nothing but quality here on jdblute.youtube or whatever. Anyway, so I have a rough idea how to make a chord. However, my first finger already hates my existence. So I'm going to I'm going to cheap out. I do 1 and 4 anyway. I, sorry. It's so hard to keep this in frame. So I do 1 and 4 anyway. Brilliant. Sounds good, no? Sounds perfect to me. Uh Ah. This is going well. I promise. Well, well, there's also that problem. Good. Good. This is going great. I can't tell if that's ringing. Hey, nailed it. Perfect. Okay. Ow. Sweet Satan, that hurts. It's been so long since I learned to play guitar, I didn't really think it would matter doing it to the other hand. Let me say, I gotta get, I gotta get into warm up position. There we go. Okay. So three, five, and then the two. We're gonna work on the right hand only, only on the fretting hand, because I feel like down picking, first of all, it's a Metallica cover, so that's warranted. Second of all, I am not going to, this video would be forever if I, if I tried that. So, three, five, make noise. Almost, almost, okay, okay. You know what you don't think about as an experienced player? You don't think about, you don't think about how much that hurts for the first little while. I, I realize I'm also doing it very wrong, but I'm not good. Oh my goodness. Okay. That was the best one so far. I don't think the strum is going to be the problem. I really feel like my right hand is going to give up uh, well before. I will also point out something, okay? I will point out how I'm holding the pick. I'm actually holding it, I think, better than I do in my regular hand. <laughs> oh, what an idiot. So the reason I wanted to do this, A, for opposite day, but B, I have actually probably mentioned this on the channel before, but this shoulder, my normal fretting shoulder, um, because you fret with your shoulders clearly, has been dislocated twice and currently still to this day has a torn labrum. So certain fretting exercises, certain things I cannot do. So when I say I will never be a shredder in my normal positioning, it's because I literally cannot build up. Not that I don't want to, not that I don't practice, I physically cannot. Sucks. Was never repaired. Wasn't even discovered until 13 years after I injured it. So that sucks. So my theory was I'm going to learn how to play left handed. Now, maybe had I changed the strings to a proper left handed orientation, we might have something that resembles luck. As it stands right now, if I try and do a standard bar, a standard power chord and not suck, gotta get in here. Oh, hey, there we go. That, do you have any idea how much conscious effort that takes? Oh, okay, we're getting somewhere. I'm sure you want to watch somebody who's not shredding play like this, though. Isn't this so exciting? 
Yeah. So far, this is going well. Wouldn't you agree? We'll give this... I was going to give this half an hour, but we're not going to give this half an hour. I'm sorry. Obviously, I would have sped it up in post, but we're not giving this half an hour because my fingers are already regretting every single life decision I have ever made. Oh, <sighs> okay. New plan. New plan. Let's just work on the bottom string, okay? It's not that hard, right? It's three to five. Like I said, three to five, perfect. You know, you don't take for granted, you take for granted how much hard work you put in at whatever stage you started. This is like, this is more difficult than, than I want to admit. Now again, not a proper lefty. I imagine, let's lie and say we're proper lefty. Okay. If everything's going well. You have no idea what to do with, with, with your offhand. You really don't. Like, you, you, <laughs> I, don't, I encourage anyone to try this, not just for internet points or not just because it's opposite day. I really do encourage anyone who's experienced with an instrument to try to flip your brain. Your brain knows what you want to do. It's the physicality. Like my, I, I know, <laughs> I know the strum pattern. Like it's ingrained into my right hand. It's one of my favorite songs to play and warm up on and just, you know, screw around with. But trying to translate that onto the complete other side of the body and this shoulder works. There's nothing wrong with it. This is strictly just, I cannot. Okay. Falls apart when you try and go to speed. Now this is why you practice with a metronome, but again, it's opposite day. We're not practicing, we're just doing. You know what? I've about had it <laughs> with so what? Let's try nothing else matters. Now I don't finger pick it. I do actually play it with a pick. So let's try. I know, I know where my fingers go. Do I know where the pick goes? We have murderized our right hand or our opposite hand if you're following along. And if you are, thank you. I appreciate you so much. So would you believe the E is much better to do that way? What is wrong with me? That e okay. Nailed it! Ha! E is incredibly easy to do if you flip your guitar upside down. So let's get back into E. It'll be the last thing we do for today. Because <laughs> my fingers are sore. Yeah. I've about had it. <laughs> My fingers have too. I'm going to jump right in. Sorry if that grosses anybody out. My fingers have absolutely had it too. Holy crap. So I really didn't plan this part all the way through. I certainly don't have a finale, unfortunately. We already did it, but here's what we tried to do. That was the actual whole goal for this video, and we failed miserably. My fingers are still sore. So if you are new to starting guitar, these things happen, okay? This is a part of the learning process. It's not a fun part, but it is a necessary part. You will get 
to playing the songs that you love eventually. And if you're experienced, try and do stupid stuff like this. It's amazing and fascinating how your brain works. Your brain knows what to play. You can play it, you know, with your eyes closed in your normal position. But if you try and flip that, you're activating a whole new set of, well, in my case, problems. But, <laughs> oh, what can I say? Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you like what you see, and this is something you'd be interested in seeing me do more of, hit that subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. I am JD Blute. Evil Unicorn is around here somewhere. Thank you so much. Be safe. Be consensual. And if you can't be good, well then, sweet Satan on a pogo stick, be good at it. Hey, thanks for watching me make an ass of myself. I hope you come back and bring somebody else. Thank you for being here this week. I'll see you Sunday and also probably Thursday.